UTB Radio is sponsored in part by T-Mobile, the new leader in network speed. For more information, visit www.tmobile.com. UTB Radio is sponsored in part by Valley Baptist Healthy Women's Center, located at 3525 International Boulevard, Brownsville, Texas. For more information, call 956-504-4038 or visit valleybaptist.net. Hello, I'm Marisa Salazar with UTB Radio, and I'm here with Erlene Leboy, who is the Student Health Services Project Coordinator at UT Brownsville. Ms. Leboy is going to talk to us today about the free exercise classes offered on campus. Ms. Leboy, what classes are being offered and at what times? We have um, Zumba, Yoga, and Tabata. We have those classes uh, from Monday through Thursday, and we offer them from 5.30 to 6.30. Uh, how can students benefit from these classes? Oh, there's like so many benefits depending, I mean, on what it is that you want. I know there's a lot of misconceptions. People don't really want to join because they say, oh, I'm not fit or, mm -hmm. you know, oh, no, I can't. That's too much or this and that. The good thing about this is that these are certified instructors. Okay. They're certified instructors, so they go by your level, mm -hmm. you know, by... I mean, all levels are welcome, of course, but according to what you can do, you know, and then they just go up from there. Mm -hmm. uh, now, there's, like I said, on Monday there's Zumba, and I've heard a lot of good things about that. Like, people take, that's like their me time, mm -hmm. you know? So they go there to, um, it's like a dance, yeah. you know? Okay, I know, I can't do it. <laughs> but, um, yeah, it's a lot of fun. It's there, like, it's enjoyable. Like, at the same time, they're getting a workout, even mm -hmm. though they're dancing. They say that, you know, it's good, like, for um, your confidence level, your uh, just endurance, like, you know, a workout, even though some people may say, well, okay, this workout is not for me, this is not for me. That's, like, Zumba. Mm -hmm. Some people enjoy dancing. And then there's Tuesdays and Thursdays we have yoga. And if you actually think about it, these are all free classes. Mm -hmm. So it's like, instead of having to pay a membership, you know, and you then it's a go. good time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can just go to these free classes by certified instructors. They have their own businesses. So, you know, yeah, yeah so. So they know, what they know what they're doing. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, they do. And then the Tabata, is, which is a little bit more intense, intense cardio, so. What is Tabata like? Uh, what kind of movements or? Actually, it's in intervals. It's oh. like um, it's like a twenty second, like nonstop. Then you have like a break, and they do it like for eight times, eight oh, times. Wow. But it's pretty intense because um, what the instructor explains is that you're burning fat during the workout and after the workout that you continue burning fat. Yeah, so it's a pretty intense thing. So like if you like to dance, it could be like Zumba. We got um, the Tuesdays and Thursdays, we got the yoga. If you like the, you know, more meditating and all this stuff. It's more relaxation, especially with like finals, um, oh, yeah. you know, all this <laughs> stuff, exams. It's your little getaway. Um, I know some people have said that they think that they, they don't like it because it's like a religion or something, oh. you know, yeah. like uh, but it's spiritual. not, yeah, mm -hmm. but it's not, it's just somewhere they relax, it's, um, it helps you with, um, j you know, stretch, they stretch you out, it's <laughs> like circulation, all this stuff, like your mind and body is just, you know, and then the Tabata, which is a little bit more intense, but still at your own level. Mm -hmm. um, why are these classes in particular being offered, like why not a different type of, of workout or like a... Well, what? you see, these classes are actually uh, provided by a grant that we have, the Suicide oh. Prevention Grant, yes. Oh, great. So, um, we just came up with different classes. We've been offering them for the past three years, I believe. Um, they will be finishing in July, mm -hmm. um, but we just want to continue. The reason why we choose these, yoga, mostly because, because from the beginning, it's been working and everybody, you know, as long as some, they, there's people interested, we will continue offering them. Uh, we had Zumba because it was requested. So this is according to what people say, oh, this is what I would like, this is what we offer. Mm -hmm. We're trying to um, change Zumba to two times a week uh, because people seem to enjoy it a lot. So just like uh, the yoga, we like to do it twice a week as well. But again, it's only until July mm -hmm. be before the whole merging like, happens. So there's a high demand. So how many students are showing up? It, it just, it varies. It varies, but I mean, we have changed locations. Uh, we were first, we were at Casa Vea, then we moved to the Rec, yeah. 
then we moved to Garza Gym, you know. <laughs> so there's different locations. Now the locations uh, that are like set and we like to keep them that way till it, uh, the grant finishes is, uh, we got Casa Bella, a Zumba, uh, I'm sorry, Zumba at Garza Gym. <laughs> and then we have Yoga and Tabata in Casa Bella. And I mean, um, as the weather permits, maybe mm -hmm. they could take the classes outside. It's been nice outside. Oh, that'd be nice, yeah. Yeah, so we'll have that. Mm -hmm. uh, do students have to sign up beforehand, or do you accept walk-ins? No, no, no. They don't have to. They don't have to sign up. Uh, it's available to students, faculty, and staff. Mm -hmm. So they just sign in upon arrival. So that's. I think that's like the good thing. We don't have oh, yeah. to, you know, keep like okay, you can't attend after if you don't attend every di every time, every day, mm -hmm. you know. So it's just available for everybody to. That's great. I like that it's very free and that mm -hmm. it's kind of like tailored to your level, right? Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. um, is there anything else that you would like to add? Um, we have, I do want to talk about another uh, s um, program that we have through mm -hmm. the suicide prevention. Okay. Just because I know we don't get a lot out there, like we put up the flyers, we just want to let everybody know. Mm -hmm. We also have a veterans group that we okay. hold, and it's That's the same cool. thing as the, and we have that bi weekly, and we have it on the website as well. Mm -hmm. We have, you know, it's uh, during lunch time, so we have for food, you know. It's, and that one is offered to the, veterans, spouses of veterans, which have to be female, and dependents, so. Uh, where, what website is this on? On the Student Health Services. Student Health Services. Yeah, or Student Affairs. It's under, like, listed in the announcements. You know, we try to advertise as much as we can. Okay, that's good. Uh, well, Ms. Laboy, thank you very much for being here today. And to our audience, thank you for joining us today. I'm Mauricio Salazar with YouTube Radio. Thank you.